Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. If you are new, I am Michelle and I hope that you're going to enjoy all the personal development content that comes onto this channel. So on today's video, I literally just want to do a continuation of what we spoke about on Monday. So if you haven't caught up on the video that we did on Monday, please do go ahead and catch up. You can actually catch it up right after this video or you can do that just before. So on Monday, I posted a video talking about why we are not committing to our dreams and why we're not staying committed to the things that we want to stay committed to and on today's video i just want to talk about something that i've realized that is possibly the reason why sometimes we do struggle committing to those things now one of the biggest things when i talk to people which i've realized with myself as well in the past is that we do struggle a lot with actually committing when we don't believe and when we don't have faith that it's actually going to work out so for instance if you start a project and you start feeling like it's not going to work out possibly because it's getting a little bit more harder or whatever the case is you start losing a little bit more faith and you're committing and start moving away from it and I think it's also so much easier to commit to something that you already know is working perfectly and is working okay so today I want to talk a little bit about just believing and staying the course and approaching your goal or your vision with a lot of faith so I was reading the word um, the other day and I came across a story that I've always known but it had such a different meaning for me this time and this is the story of the woman with the issue of blood in the Bible and what happens with the story I'm just going to rephrase it for you guys just so i can get my point across so what happens with the story is there's a woman who had been suffering with the issue of blood for about 12 years and when she hears that jesus is in town and jesus is actually you know healing people in town she says to herself i need to actually touch the hem of his garment so that i can be healed and one of the things that the bible illustrates a lot with their words is that jesus was actually walking where there was a lot of people it was almost so almost like a stampede where there was a lot of people actually walking through and what all of that said she had to press in through those people to actually touch the hem of his garment and Jesus stopped and said who touched me and the word of God says she was then healed right after she touched Jesus and one of the things that I've realized from that scripture that was so powerful for me was the fact that she actually touched him because she believed that only if she could do it he was going to be healed so if you read in the passage it talks about how Jesus didn't even know who touched him because there was a lot of people it wasn't an open space where she was just running to go touch him but there was a lot of people there and I just started thinking the amount of faith that would make this woman so committed to pressing in into this place where there's a lot of people and just scrubbing whatever the case is to touch the hem of Jesus garment is something that I think that we need to also be able to apply in our lives and it also just begins with faith you know do you believe that the vision that God has placed in your heart is something that you are capable of and I mean it goes back to the conversations we've been having about your ability to trust yourself and how it is so important for you to be begin to trust yourself when you trust the God in you and you trust the vision that's been placed in you it becomes so much easier for you to actually press in towards the goal and press in towards all the things that you are meant to do and I just want to instill that to you this week to say that I know you are working on your commitment issues I know you are working on your ability to commit from the video that we posted on Monday but I want you to also start looking at your faith levels your believing levels in all the things that you want to do do you believe in yourself enough to realize that you are going to do this and only you can make it work do you believe in your vision and in your dreams to actually realize that there is a bunch of people there is a nation there is a community that is waiting on you to step up that is waiting on you to start working on that vision start working on that channel start working on that business and start working on all those things that you've had a desire to work on so that lives can be changed and i think that's where we need to actually start internally for us to be able to be moving forward and to be committing in our dreams we need to start having faith so i just want to impart that and instill that in you this week that as you move and as you learn to commit start having faith with the things that you want to do over your life and guys look at it this way the people that you look up to the people that you want to be like the people who you admire possibly resemble a type of strength and believing in themselves that you want so bad and sometimes I definitely think that what separates the people that commit and the people that don't commit is just a thin line between believing and having faith so I just want us to start approaching this week approaching our goals approaching every single thing that we've always wanted to do with the belief that we can make it work and with the belief that we are going to make it work and without any doubt but with faith that the vision that God has given you and the desires that you have are definitely going to work for you.
so this was a short video and with all of that said i really hope that this video was super fruitful for you now i know i've been talking a lot about coming up with a mentorship program this has been a conversation that's been going ahead all over my instagram stories and i have officially listened so i am launching a new mentorship program that's going to be an intensive six week one-on-one -on -one program with only a number of people unfortunately because i wanted to be a one-on-one -on -one and i really wanted to be super up close with the people that are going to enroll for it i can only take a certain number of people so i'm going to be launching it today so if this is something that you definitely want to be part of and if this is something you possibly want to invest in the link is going to be down below click on the enroll i have an early bird special that is going for 25 dollars at the moment but from the 25th going onwards the price is going to go up to its original price so i hope to see some of you guys there and i really hope that we are going to be able to just unpacking your vision unpacking your goals unpack all the mental bondages that have held you from taking action held you from starting and held you from just moving forward towards the life that you've always wanted to and i'm so excited that i actually get to do this with a number of you there are a couple of people that have already enrolled so i only have a few spaces left i love you guys so 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 much and i will see you on my next video on friday have yourself an awesome day Mwah.